Thank you, Jen. First on COVID origins, you said from that podium that under no circumstance would President Biden ever fire Dr. Fauci. Is that still the case since Fauci told Congress the NIH never funded gain of function research for coronaviruses in Wuhan, but documents published by The Intercept suggest that is not true, which would mean that he misled Congress? Well, first, I would say that NIH uh, has uh, refuted uh, that reporting, um, and I would point you to that. But let me give you some highlights of that. Uh, NIH has never approved any research that would make a coronavirus more dangerous to humans. A reminder that there are previous and different coronaviruses than the existing one we're battling. And the body of science produced by this research demonstrates that the bat coronavirus sequences published from that work uh, Emma, NIH supported were not. Uh, COVID, the, the strain, COVID-2 strain. Uh, so what he said was correct. So his job is safe. Correct. Okay, moving on. Can you explain a little bit more about why the White House in a statement is calling the Taliban business-like and professional? Well, I would note that in that statement, what we were announcing was the fact that a Qatari uh, Airlines flight successfully landed in Qatar with American citizens, legal permanent residents, and Afghans uh, on board who uh, joined us in our fight over the last several years. Uh, we wanted to note that the Taliban was cooperative in facilitating the departure of these American citizens and legal permanent residents from HKIA. We promised we would get American citizens out. We promised we would get legal permanent residents out. We promised we would get our Afghan partners out. And we promised we'd press the Taliban to get them out. And that's exactly what we did. Well, you're saying the Taliban is businesslike and professional. Their interior minister has an FBI wanted poster. He's got a $10 million bounty on his head. That's What's the business? We are here to celebrate the return of American citizens who wanted to leave Afghanistan, of legal permanent residents, of Afghans who fought by our side, to Qatar successfully on a Qatar Airlines flight. Uh, and in order to get those people out, we had to work with some members of the Taliban to press them uh, and to work uh, in a business-like manner to get them out. Okay. That is what we were stating in the statement. And in that statement, it says this is a positive first step. Towards what? Towards getting additional people out who want to leave Afghanistan.